Hello everyone, I am Joseph, your dance instructor for today, and this is master drama, Eddie. Today we are going to learn a dance called Panlogo. Panlogo is a dance from Ghana with Africa, by the natives called the Gans. This dance is a recreational dance brought into existence by these Ghana people during the 1950s. It is a dance which talks about daily life activities. So there are many places you go in Ghana where people would perform this dance in so many ways because they are talking about daily life activities. So get ready and we are going to dance follow. In West African dance, we have four important elements that we should take notice of. One is the rhythm. We listen to the rhythm and we communicate with the drama, with our dance movements. The second one will be your gestures. The gestures we do signifies something. So every gesture you see that I'm doing has a meaning. So you do the same thing. The third one will be our posture. So we always have to be in this position, this posture. You turn like this for you to see. So this is how it goes like. Yes, that's our posture. And then the final one will be our expression. Dancing with a bright, smiling face makes everyone enjoy what you're doing. So let's enjoy this dance and have fun. Thank you. For the Kwan Logo dance, it begins with a break. You change from one variation to another variation with a break. And then we end the dance with a break. So let's learn the break movement and then the rhythm as well. So I'm going to break it down from the legs to the hand. I'll join it together and then we add the rhythm. So the leg goes like this. You open the heel and close it. Okay, so it goes open, close. Now the hand is like this. You push and flip. Okay, you push, drop the hand, and flip together with legs it goes push flip and then you one two bounces I'm going to turn this way so that you can see it from this side so five six ready go push flip one two one more time five six ready go push flip one, two. So the pushing goes to the opening of the leg. And then when you flip, the leg closes. Good. Now let's listen to the rhythm for the break. It has eight counts or eight downbeats for the rhythm. So we have a point where we respond with a push, which is the fourth beat. So let's listen to the full break rhythm. Five, six, ready, go. Listen to the rhythm and the counting of the downbeats. Five, six, ready, go. So we have eight counts. Now we are going to respond on the fourth count, which is the fourth beat. So he's going to play and I'll demonstrate. And then on the fourth beat, that is where I will respond with a push and flip. So let's go. Five, six, ready, go. One more time. Five, six, ready, go. Very good. So that is the break for you. Now we are going to start the dance with variation one. Variation one, let's do the leg movement. I'll do the hand movement. We combine together, we do with the rhythm. So this is the leg movement. It goes heel, step, heel, step. That's for the leg movement. The hand movement, you have your hands here, right to the side, you bring it back, you flip, and then left to the side. 
So let's combine the two with the hand and the leg. So we are here, it goes right, left, right, left. Good. That is the variation one movement. Now we are going to do on the rhythm from the break to the variation. There is a connection between the, the break and the variation. So this is what you do. So after the break, push, flip, one, two, step, right, step, left, step, right, step, left. So let's go with the rhythm. From the break to the variation, one, five, six, ready, go. to learn it's called plug the mango or plug the souvenir so the variation number one we call it appreciating universe so this variation we are going to do which is our number two it's called plug the mango from the leg movement the posture is important you go left right crossing the right in the front cross open cross kick when you kick you bring it to cross cross open cross kick so the count is one two three kick one two three kick now the hand you swing the hand like this one two three plug after you plug you go one, two, three, clock. So I'm going to combine the leg and the hands. Five, six, ready, go. One, two, three, clock. One, two, three, clock. One, two, three, clock. One, two, three, clock. So now let's try. The variation from the break but with this variation after the push and flip of the break you don't do bounce you just go straight into the variation you do push flip you start walking crossing with the left leg to the right side in front okay when you bounce it's not going to align with the rhythm so let's try that five six Ready, go. So our third variation is what we call the push and pull. We are going to hop back eight counts and hop to the front eight counts. So that will be our push, hopping back, pull, hopping forward. Eight counts to the back, eight counts to the front. We're going to demonstrate just the legs. It's just hopping backwards and hopping front. Okay? Eight counts, eight counts. Let me do that and then I'll add the hands and then we join it together. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now I'm going to add the hand. The hand you push. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight and then hopping forward you pull one two three four five six seven eight so combining it and demonstrating let's go five six ready go one two three four five six seven eight and one two three four five six seven eight okay so with the pushing you start from your right side to the center to the left side back to the center and then you pull just in the center like you're pulling a rope okay now with the rhythm from the break into the variation five six ready go which will be our last one for today we call it a cross kick so let's learn the leg movement we add the hand movement we combine the drum comes in so starting with the right foot cross open with the left step on the right heel bring the back the leg back down you cross with the left in the front Open from the back with the right, step on the heel of the left, okay? Then we step back. So that's how it goes. So it goes cross, open, heel, step, cross, open, heel, step. Good. That is how it goes. But then this is breaking it down. So I'm going to pace it up. So it goes cross, open, cross, open, cross, open, cross, open. So from here, you hop with the right foot, you push yourself or you pop up and then you swing the leg. So when you're going to your left side, the right leg must cross in the front. So cross, open. And when you are Hop into your right side. The left leg must cross in the front. Cross, open. Okay. Now the hand, you just swing the hands like that, like that, like that, like that. Okay. So let's add the two, five, six. Ready, go. Cross, open. Cross, open. Cross, open. Cross open cross open cross and open now from the break variation break five six ready go with a break and then we go into that it's simple and everyone can do it you just shake the body off okay five six from the break the whole thing we start with a jamming okay so we're going to do a clapping 
okay? And then he comes in with the break. Okay, we shake our body, we warm the body, and then we start. So the clapping goes like this. One, two, a right, left. One, two, and then he'll come in with the drumming. Okay, drama, let's go.